Okay, this is a quick and easy video on how to um, look after praying mantises. They're really docile pets, you know, they'll just sit on you like he is now. If I prod him, he'll probably move a bit. Yeah, they're really good pets. They're really cheap. They take like no space to um, look after. Um, so we'll start with where you need to keep him. Um, you need to keep him in a one gallon aquarium or terrarium, it doesn't matter. Um, this is two gallon to put into perspective. So like half that. Um, you can just put branches in and you'll climb around on them. Or like what I've done, you can put in some fish stuff. I'm um, right for a subtrate, which is basically like the gravel for mine. You don't need gravel but it matches the fish stuff on mine. You could put sand or tissue paper or anything. Right. So what you need to feed him? Standard mealworms. Anything really. Any live they have to feed on something living. Can't be dead. So crickets are good because they move around. So go and take one of them out. Or locust. Don't feed him anything too big. If you imagine the size of his abdomen, that's about the size of the animal you should be feeding him, maybe a bit bigger. Um, yeah. And do you want to spray the um terrarium? I got this at um Petco. Um I use warm water, not cold water, because it actually warms up the terrarium. You don't need to keep it under a light or anything. Just keep it at room temperature in a warm area of your house. Don't keep it by a window where it's cold. Keep it in a warm area of your house under a normal light, because lights give off heat and it will brighten up the terrarium for him. Um, they live to about a year, at the very longest. But yeah, if you want to, you can breed them. They're super easy to breed. But, I mean, you have to feed the the mother whilst breeding or she'll eat the, ma the male. And that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, um, he's a sub-adult. Um, they come as nymphs. Very small as nymphs. You won't need anything like that. Literally like a cup with a, po a lollipop stick or something in it for them to climb on. And feed them fruit flies. And then slowly progress from fruit flies to bigger flies to mini crickets all the way up to like m big locust children but yeah he's a sub adult so he just eats standard crickets standard mealworms that's about it but yeah I think that's all if there's anything else comment and give me a good, good shout goodbye from me and Bolt